Hi everyone. Well, in a rare case of actually recording the review before the book comes out, uh, I would like to do a short review of Immortalized to Death. Uh, let me see. Uh, that was by Lynn Squire, I believe. Yeah. Hold on. Let me check my list. Yes. Lynn Squire um, wrote Immortalized to Death. It's about... Uh, it's a f fictitious imagining of the death of Charles Dickens, that it might have been a murder. And the clues are in that uh, book about Edwin Drood. Do I have that right? I'm not up on my Dickens. I'm not very good about that kind of thing. I wasn't a lit major. Sorry. Anyway, having said that, I thought it was a really interesting book and just, just a great accounting of um, what might have happened. So um, if you're into Charles Dickens, you'll definitely love it. Um, I, th I think you don't have to be into Charles Dickens to love it, though. I mean, it's just cool the way it's written and um, you know, kind of hearkening back to that era and uh, paying homage to it at the same time as the author speculates about how this book he had been working on at the end of his life might have factored into his own death. <laughs> so anyway, I thought it was a really good read and a lot of fun. And I'm, I actually finished it before the thing was released. I, I you know, I can't believe it. <laughs> so yay for me, I guess. Um, and do read it. It's, it, it's great fun and, and, and a good read. And um, that's it. I'll talk to you later. Thanks.